Lock, door, stop. Right. What's the time? Uh, exactly 41 seconds. 41. Uh, here's yeah. what I think happened. Yeah, exactly. The old man heard the fight between the boy and his father a few hours earlier. Then when he's lying in his bed, he heard the body hit the floor in the boy's apartment, heard the woman scream from across the street, got to his front door as fast as he could, heard somebody racing down the stairs, and assumed it was the boy. I think that's possible. Assumed? <laughs> Brother, I've seen all kinds of dishonesty in my day, but this little display takes the cake. You all come in here with your hearts bleeding all over the floor about slum kids and injustice. You listen to some fairy tales, suddenly you start getting through to some of these old ladies. Well, you're not getting through to me. I've had enough. What's the matter with you guys? You all know he's guilty. He's got to burn. You're letting him slip through our fingers. Slip through our fingers? Are you his executioner? I'm one of them. Perhaps you'd like to pull the switch. Well, this kid, you bet I would. I feel sorry for you. What it must feel like to want to pull the switch. Ever since you walked into this room, you've been acting like a self-appointed public avenger. You want to see this boy die because you personally want it, not because of the facts. You're a sadist. You don't really mean you'll kill me, do you? <laughs> 